Hey guys, LBF back here, back again with another Vans review. Today we are taking a look at the OG Authentic LX. This is from the Bedwin and the Heartbreaker collection. Colorway on this is Bandana Multicolor C, size 13. Retail on these was 110. Once again, coming in this amazing box here featuring the bandana stacked print. Pretty much all over, you got the gold foil Heartbreaker hit on the top there. Paramount quality, super sick box. So here we have the red colorway of the Bedouin and the Heartbreaker Authentic. Uh, in my initial review of the navy blue and purple pair, these guys right here, which if you guys haven't seen this review already, I'll leave the link down in the description below. But in my initial review of these shoes, I thought there were more colorways in this pack, honestly. After seeing more detailed pictures of the shoes, uh, it looks like there are a lot less than I expected. I thought there were six shoes in this pack. Turns out there's only four. There's three Authentics and one pair of old schools. So for the Authentics, you're gonna have the red one here, the blue and purple one, and then the multicolor one, which has pretty much a different colored bandana on each uh, quarter of the shoe or each piece of the shoe except for the toe box I think those are both like a navy so you got a bunch of primary colors on that one and then even for the old school it's kind of the same design with just like each piece being a different color so those two I guess were the the loudest or the craziest in the pack those those two um, totally multicolored ones the Red Authentics here are probably the most muted, at least in my opinion, just being that the upper of it is is the most like monochromatic. The blue ones, I would say almost, I mean the purple and the blue definitely blend together, but then this aqua hits so hard that like it's definitely, you know, a standout. Whereas for this one, you got the like darker red, this like almost maroon-like red on the toe, your standard red on the lateral, and then the pink. It's like a pinkish purple color that makes up the medial side here, but it doesn't quite hit as hard as the aqua does. So I think it really does give it that like monochromatic look, which I really dig. I think Dick should have done this with more colors and kept it kind of simple, but you know, that's just my two cents on it. The multicolor one with the yellow, I think was my least favorite in the pack. Just being that that yellow was just way too loud and kind of obnoxious, in my opinion, of course. I think that might have actually been the most popular uh, shoe in the collection. A lot of people feeling the the uniqueness of, you know, each panel being different, which I get. Um, but these ones, yeah, the red ones here, by far my favorite in the pack and definitely going to be one of my top five shoes for this year. Absolutely love how these came out. Uh, if you guys haven't already seen my other re review on the blue pair, uh, just a quick background on this collection. Better Than the Heartbreakers is a menswear streetwear brand that's based out of Tokyo, Japan. They've been around forever, since like 2005, I believe, or sometime around then. Um, this is their first Vans collaboration. And for this particular collaboration, they use their inspiration with Americana and really like driving home with the, the bandana print. And these are actually gonna be like vintage made in the USA bandanas that they use for the collection here. So with that being said, no two shoes supposedly are the same, which is amazing. You know, you do get a different pattern for each, uh, each style. As you can see these two red prints are, they have some, Similarities, but overall definitely a different design on them. The pink as well. I think my favorite part of the particular print that I got is the toe box being so simple. All that empty space on it, I dig that. The other pair here, the navy, was just super loud with the print on the toe box. And I think the other shoe was like the same exact print almost. But yeah, this was just too much for me. Even the side of it, like there's a lot of print on there. Um, you know, nothing against this shoe. Still love these, but if I had it my way, for sure, like I love the empty space on it, just to keep it simple. And then like the loudest part is on the medial side with the pink. So like that's literally a perfect cut for me. 
These do sit on top of your white OG midsoles here with the red boxing stripe. You got your red off the wall originals heel tab, which of course works perfect with this colorway. And then you got the suede quad stitching strip on the heel here. On the interior of the shoe, you got your small Bedouin and Heartbreakers hit with the Paramount quality and that vinyl heel and then the checkerboard print lining the rest of the insole there. You got your white premium cotton laces there, white eyelets, white Vans flag with the black Vans hit. There is no print on the reverse, just pretty simple with that. And you got the tongue tag here with this unique little hit, the vault and the heartbreakers, paramount quality, same thing we saw on the top of the box. You don't ever see like tags on authentics, tongue tags on authentics. So definitely uh, something that makes this particular collection unique. And then on the reverse, you have your typical pro verbiage there with the Vans world's number one skateboard shoe. Kind of random, but cool nonetheless. Yellow outsoles, by the way, I don't know why, but yellow outsoles, SpongeBob vibes on these. This is pretty much the same for the whole collection on the yellow outsoles. Not sure if that's, you know, specifically for or something, but interesting fun fact by the way the colorways on these are actually dubbed i think it's bandana multicolor either a b or c for the authentics so i think the red ones here are c the blue and purple ones that i reviewed are b and then the the multicolor with the yellow is actually a so that's the official colorway for these Multicolor bandana, multicolor ABC. Thought that was a little weird, but uh, yeah. So nevertheless, that's it right there. That is the authentic, the OG authentic LX from the Bedouin and the Heartbreakers collection. You guys can find these for $110 retail, and they are going to be available at pretty much every single vault account. Um, at least the ones that get like collaborations. I know there's a couple that just kind of get the the never out colorways, but um, any of any of the vault accounts that get collaborations, definitely pick these up. And it seems like there's still pretty good size runs everywhere. Should not be a hard one to find. All you gotta do is Google Bedouin and the Heartbreakers Vans. You will definitely find these. Um, fit on these true to size, pretty much your standard OG authentic fit. And hope you guys enjoy the review. Be sure to stay tuned for the on feet.